All right, uh, first things first, what brought you up to Traverse City? Well, um, you know, I'm just excited to be here. Uh, I want to thank uh, Petty Tibaldi and the, the Traverse City community for uh, giving me such a great opportunity. Traverse City is a, a beautiful place, and uh, the more that I've been around here, I, I've come to realize that uh, the people here are great too. And, uh, you know, I think that's what really separates uh, the place that you want to be is, is the great people. So I'm excited to be here. And what about uh, Traverse City West Senior High in general? What have you noticed looking into their program and the high school that uh, really attracted you to be a part of this? Yeah, um, you know, th there's some tradition here at Traverse City West. Uh, we, we look to build on the foundation that's kind of been set by Coach Graham and those before him. Um, some things we'll be doing different, but uh, some things will be similar as well. Um, you know, this is the first day I've been able to meet the players, so I'm, uh, I'm, I'm really happy that uh, they were here to support me at this conference, and uh, you know, I look forward to, to getting to meet them and know them uh, better here as the, as the year progresses. What was that first interaction like with the team? You know, kind of describe to me what kind of emotions were going through you and kind of how, what kind of the welcome was like. Yeah, I mean, it, it was great, you know, just to uh, you hear about the guys and, and what the team is going to look like, but to finally meet the guys and uh, have them here, um, it was just a, an awesome experience. Tell me a little about your, bas uh, your basketball background, you know, what's uh, gotten you to this point now as a head coach of a major high school program here in Northern Michigan? Um, well, I, I played at a high school similar to this, Hudsonville, down in the Grand Rapids area. Uh, after that, I went over to uh, Hope College, played for Glenn Weirin, Hall of Fame coach. Um, who's known by, by many across the state. And then uh, I played five years professionally in Europe, and uh, most recently I was at Michigan State working for Tom Izzo on his staff. And so, uh, you know, all those experiences have taught me different things. And, uh, you know, as, as a young aspiring coach, you, you pick the things that you like, you take those with them, and you kind of kind of leave the, leave the rest where they are and uh, you know it becomes your philosophy and that's that's what I'm going to do. Did you get a chance to meet with Coach Graham at all or talk with him? I haven't. Um, what, what do you as far do you plan to in the near future here get in touch with him? Yeah I mean when, uh, when, when the opportunity's there and, uh, and he's around and I'm around I'm you know obviously going to be working on moving into the area here in the, in the next couple of weeks and uh, it's going to be busy but uh, when the opportunity comes you know I'd be happy to speak with him and uh, learn from his experiences here with the program and uh, and just kind of get his thoughts about uh, the things he thinks that uh, we can do to, to improve. And so what's your, as far as your first big goal as coach, you know, maybe before, obviously the season doesn't get underway for another six months here, as, as far as summer going into fall, yeah. what, what's your first, you know, big fingerprint you want to leave on this program? Well, I mean, the goal for all our players will be just that they're prepared once they leave Traverse City West, um, academically, athletically, um, and, and as people. To, uh, to succeed at the next level, whether they're playing basketball or not. Um, but we do want to give them the skills that if they're, if they're good enough that you know, they'll be prepared to play at the next level, um, just like academically and, and as a person in society. So that's the, that's the, the main overall goal. Um, in terms of on the court, you know, we're going we're gonna to really focus on skill development. Um, we, wanna, we want guys that can shoot pass dribble and, uh, and uh, you know, hopefully that translates into a lot of wins here. Uh, over the next couple of years, and uh, you know, I, I just look forward to, to helping guys get better.